What's up guys, Chris Akova, welcome to another one of my videos. Now today we are looking at my latest mini mock, which is on Sullust. Now today, as per usual, we're going to talk about the scenery and then the story and figures behind it afterwards. Now, as you will know, on Sullust, uh, the, well, there's a, there's a lot of lava, right? And a lot of black and grey and, yeah, dark, dark stuff. There's pretty much just dark stuff there. So basically, with my detailed description of what Sullust is, uh, well, I've basically used dark grey slash black plates uh, for most of the ground, as you can see. Here, I've only elevated this layer and then the rest. As you can see, actually, right at the bottom, I've done just black. And then I've put black plates with dark grey splatters around. Because uh, I think in Salast, um, there was some dark grey. But I don't know if it was, like a mix or not but I decided just to mix it because some mocks have just black some mocks have dark grey so I thought mix it and yeah it, it looks pretty cool actually it's way more um, detailed and without it, it wouldn't look that great uh, the reason why I did that layer underneath by the way is for this lava so as you can see because what I did before is I wouldn't put anything underneath I'd only have one layer and then I just put the lava there and then you'd be able to see the green or grey or whatever coloured boards at the bottom. But this time uh, I did the black. Well no, I did that I think with my other mini mop. Yeah, as you can see here, uh, I had a brown plate underneath. So I have done it in uh, one of my other mini mops, but like before that, I haven't done that before. Now, as you can see, I've used red and orange transparent studs uh, I've used a mix and it also like with the black and gr dark grey is more detailed and it looks much nicer as you can see I've kind of done like a V shape now onto the story well, I mean all my mini mocks they don't really have much of a story but I'm oh sorry I forget to let it focus uh, basically Darth Maul has uh, escapes this is obviously I'm just saying this is not based on anything true but this is a bit before the time of Revenge of the Sith and like just around like Clone Wars season 7 time Darth Maul has basically gone to Sullust and he's just basically trying to kill I think it's Newt Gunray yeah Newt Gunray he's trying to kill him and he's basically going through all these droids now this like I said is not based on anything true I don't even know if New Gun Ray was he? No, he was alive at this time. But I don't even know if he is at this place at the time. But yeah, I've, I've you know I've made it up, okay? So just allow it, okay? Now onto the what's going on. Obviously you've got New Gun Ray, he's cowering uh, behind these two super battle droids. He's slowly walking backwards, obviously. If he walks any further, he's gonna burn his feet. But yeah. <laughs> yeah, you've got the two super battle droids who just aim their guns at Darth Maul. Darth Maul's looking hella sick, as you can see. He just cut the head off of the battle droid here and cut the body off this battle droid, which you can see is just falling down. And he is slowly burning. Now you can see this uh, battle droid is actually just sinking in the lava, so he's just burning to death. As you can see, I use white tack. And then you've got another dead battle droid there. And that's actually pretty much uh, my mock. So I hope you guys did enjoy this. Isn't that it's quite a short one. Next week, I'll be making a showcase of all four mocks I did, and I'm going to compare them with each other, see which one's the best and worst, whether I've improved or not. And yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy this. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And as you can see, 79% of you aren't subscribed to me. What are you doing? Please do subscribe to me. Uh, it would mean a lot. Uh, it would be greatly appreciated. So yeah, I'll, I'll see you in the next video.